What's up, y'all? This is Mag1381 Entertainment. Hey guys, what's going on? Mag1381. Today I'm gonna be doing a video for um Asian Invasion something or other. Part apologize. Uh, he wanted to see all my tools. Um, I have so many tools I can't even like express to you on how much I have. Um, not only the landscaping tools, but like everything else. Let me show you today on um, what it takes, what kind of tools it takes to fix your equipment and to do different things and a few things that I don't have that I'm going to tell you about. Um, first, you need all your landscaping equipment. You need your trailer, a truck, and then you need your trimmers, your, your blowers, um, and you need your, hand, your rakes and shovels and stuff here. And your mower, of course, your mower. And which is always nice to have is a John Deere wagon or, or a wagon to have, especially when you're doing excavation or you're redoing beds because this makes it so easy just to load everything in and drive around and then dump it somewhere because you can dump with that. Uh, <clears throat> Alright, so here's my toolbox. Um, I, it's all like jumbled up I have gotten I've got so many different tools here different screws um, little mini wrenches for different things and then here's like my home like drawer here stuff from my house um, and then little s bigger wrenches and then here it's like staple gun stuff like that no staples um, but I've got a lot of other tools in the basement empty see and then here's like some bigger ones and then here's my apex set um, and there my apex set and then um, more sockets. I've got like 15 or 20 different sets of sockets uh, just random drawers uh, Different car things and drill bits and shit like that um, that I use a uh, pipe cutter for cutting pipe when I'm doing irrigation um, Moving on different drawer for random dickerness Alright, so here you have impact wrenches, um, you got your jacks, which I have another three downstairs. These jacks make it really easy, especially for when um, I am either get my mower stuck um, and I can't get it, I can just grab one of these and quickly put it underneath it. Uh, the real light, damn, I've got so much shit down here. Okay, so that drawer won't close, but down here, oh, there we go. Um, I have my buffer for my truck, more Apex in there, uh, di and just different gadgets, chargers, uh, A-frame, shit like that for the old four-wheeler, um, and just different things um, that you need. All right, now I have got to organize all this, and I'm gonna do that this summer. This here is my Ryobi. Um, it's kind of funny that I have a Ryobi. It's a battery-operated, 12 volt, 8 in 18 inch um, hedge trimmer that I use um, for when I climb really high and doing different things because it's so light. I love it. I don't use it much. Um, then just the RC cars and crap like that. Here is my shelf um, that I keep all where my miracle grow and stuff like that goes for different plants. Um, we have these things called Japanese beetles, um, which um, they come uh, and they just attack everything. Um, here's Vigora uh, rose food uh, for some of my clients. They have roses and stuff, and I take care of all that for them. Um, just different stuff we have um uh different starters whoa uh different starters uh here's bloom start which bag is too big but i have just so much different shit yellow jacket it's nice especially for when my clients have like you know yellow jackets i go ahead and install that for them okay so now we're in my shop um and this is where i fix my mowers and it fixed different things. It got me a Coca Cola. Yeah, good Coke. It's where I fix my mowers uh, down here. Uh, there's the Echo SRMP25. Um, there's the JX75. It sits here just like this, um, only because I and I have to put the handle up only because I don't have enough room. Um, there's my air compressor, which I, you know, when I do stuff, my pressure washer sits over there, and all my other tools sit there. 
Um, which some of it's upstairs because every time I leave for a job, it's just too much of a pain in the ass. Um, I have a cone um, for when I'm on different jobs. Um, I put this out in the road so people don't run over me. Um, different parts box. And let me show you this here. Uh, that blade there is for the, the snapper. Um, old part for the John Deere. I got my clippers here. Um, these flags here are what I use for when I mark people's sprinkler heads right before we um, begin irrigation or um, fixing new irrigation. Um, it just makes it easier on me or when we aerate people's yards. Um, just makes it easy on me. Uh, new blades for, for my dad's John Deere. My dad, he's got his John Deere now. He just bought it from me. Um, I do not own that John Deere anymore. I got my screwdrivers here. I have some of these actually on my truck right now because um, these um, are for my steels. You can see uh, different heads. I also got flat heads for the chainsaws. I've got like 10 of these probably. Um, they just give them to me. Uh, and um, I just different screws, you know. Um, oh, I've got all my oil here. Um, the different two cycle oils for the echoes and stuff like that power blends uh there's my still high performance oil um i've got my stable um which i don't typically use but sometimes occasionally um i have only 10w30 uh some 10w30 some more 10w30 some green spray paint you gotta have the green spray paint um and then i've just got just bunches of stuff here you know um and just different tools all along, earplugs for the employees, because gotta take care of my employees. If I offer them to them, if they don't want to wear them, that's their problem. Here's my machete, which I use for cutting sod. Um, we also use the edgers for cutting sod, but we like to use this especially for when we're fitting, because it's just so much easier. How to take another chip. Um, I've got brooms, I've got, there's another jack. And there, there's another one in there, and there should be another one under there probably. Um, and I, here's some more different stuff over here. I've got my more blowers. I, here's my solo backpack sprayer. Um, okay, this stuff, Andro, is the best fire ant killer I can express to you. How good it does. Let me tell you guys, I would use it or at least try it. Uh, here's my Roundup, which I use for. Um, uh, different things, uh, I mean, to kill, uh, concentrate plus, it's the red top, look for that, when you go to the store, get some, it's like $20, nineteen ninety nine. um, it works, in 12 hours, it starts to kill, um, different oil filled replacements, um, for my shop vax, um, here's my SAE, um, ADW90, all multi-purpose gear lubricant, which I use, um, for different things that just, you know, that I need, um, oh gosh, um, here, which I took off of a job, Weed Be Gone, they gave this to me because I was using my other stuff, um, now here is Roundup, uh, Rainproof in 30 minutes, I like this stuff, but for some reason the red stuff works better to me. Here is a metal gas can with old gasoline in it. We use that for the old stuff. Um, here is my more miracle blood meal, uh, uh, deep greening and organic treatment. Uh, it's more mir mir miracid, um plant food, which we use. Uh, let me show you this here, guys. Um, which God, if I can get it out. Um, this here is how I. I inject um, the roots of plants with this, um, only to with plant food to help the roots grow out. You can see how the end. Every landscaper needs to have one. I'll put that back later. Um, I got my paint for the house and crap like that down there. More plant food. Um, I got my mag light here, which we use in the dark. Um, tiles and more drills up there um toolbox with extra spare parts to almost every tool i have um here we are we got 
the, some more oil. We can't have enough oil, guys. You always want to take care of your equipment there. More paint. Sorry, you can't see that. Um, and then you got all your batteries down there. Those are all the batteries I've ever used. Um, this here came out of the old snapper. That one over there came out of, out of my dad's old mower. And the other one, when I had to get me a new battery for the X Mark. Look, found me a screwdriver. That will go there. Um, and then these here are my mud boots for when we fertilize um, or anything like that because fertilizer is very dangerous, especially different kinds that you use. Um, we also use this for um, different, different occasions. These here are screws um, which somebody has given to me. They're very, very expensive. You can see that the head on them. See if you'll focus. See the head is way different. They're very hard to come by. There's my jack stands, which I use to lift up the mower. This is gonna be a very long video, guys. Um, and just different things. Sprinklers for when we, when I establish, um, when I plant sod and they don't have a sprinkler system, I go ahead and throw some of these down. I've got about five more of these um, and hoses just to go with every single one of them. Just different tools, as you can see. Um, here's the John Deere seat and yeah, so that's about it guys. That's about all my tools and everything what it takes to run a company um, This video is gonna be probably 10 to 15 minutes long Hope you enjoyed it. Um, I Was gonna switch gears. Oh, let me show you all this here um, Walking outside now here's where we keep all of our um, wheelbarrows and stuff like that right here i put this down um with all these bricks that i found um in my backyard uh when they were building my house i put all these there so we wouldn't have mud and stuff um and then here which i gotta fix this bike actually today i gotta go on a trip but this is an old broken thing i need to throw that take that to the dump here's where i keep all my ladders my extension ladders um, for going to big jobs of wood pile I need to take care of. Stuff like that, you know. Uh, sh there's a shovel. I just have to got to clean all this up. Please don't make fun of me. And my bungee hose, which is awesome. So anyway, guys. Um, yeah, this going to be like 10 to 15 minutes long today. Um, I just, you know, um, Asian Invasion was really asking for this. So I figured I'd go ahead and do it because I have not done it. But this is everything it takes to run a company everything you will need all the tools you'll need to run a company um, there's just so much different stuff you know like grinders and stuff sharpening your blades I mean so much other stuff that y'all that I have not shown you um, I mean I, I've just toolboxes and and gas tank city you know I mean that's how many gas tanks I have only because of one for every different um, set of tools like echo uh, sometimes we use that gas tank there or that one there for a five gallon mix of uh, two cycle especially when we're busy during the summer and we need gas a lot of it um, then here is the toolbox that I'll take on to jobs when I'm um, installing irrigation or fixing irrigation I have just rope and different things to feed wires um, and I mean b extra batteries and screws and I have drills and and line string tr trimmer line I know y'all probably won't be able to see that and gloves and just different things that we need um and not everything I need for those kind of jobs are in there but anyway guys I really appreciate you watching make sure you rate comment and subscribe and I will see y'all tomorrow see ya